This is an original, iconic 7-Eleven team bike from 1988. Branded Huffy, these Sorota-built steel frames were ridden by the new wave of North American racers infiltrating the European peloton. This bike was made on the 13th of November 1987 and was used by the team in 1988 until it actually crashed out of the Tour de France on the stage to lose Ardiden. It's built up with original Shimano Dura 7400 with 7-speed seven gearing and downtube shifters and beautiful Wolba rims laced to Shimano Dura hubs. It weighs just shy of 9 kilos, heavy by today's standards but perfectly competitive for its time. As a tribute to this pioneering team, Sorota, in collaboration with CycleFit London, have produced this modern incarnation of that classic bike in March 2013, paying homage to the original colour scheme and cutting edge design. This is their Maivici frame, the top of Sorota's range. Featuring lugged carbon construction, it means that each bike can be tailored for individual riders in a vast number of different combinations. Custom geometry and custom tubing combinations all give each bike a unique fingerprint according to the requirements of the rider. This is much the same as in 1988, but the carbon instead of steel sheds a huge amount of weight. The paint job is a great modern twist on the original 7-Eleven with the iconic colour combination of white, green and red. It pays homage to the original perfectly, but all that's missing is a decal saying Huffy. The bike is specced with the latest Dura-Ace 9000 group set, eight more gears than the original from 25 years previously. Mavic Cosmic Carbone wheels replace the aluminium box section rims and stainless steel spokes. It has a Physique Arione saddle and custom painted carbon seat post, bar and stem. We didn't get to weigh this bike, but we'd expect it to be nearly two kilos lighter than the original as well. A worthy tribute to an important slice of history and a beautiful contrast of 25 years of cycling history. Choose a link which doesn't already have a joining pin. Once the tool is in place, simply twist it until the link pops out the other side. The link you pop out is redundant and can be binned.